Hey, this is Scaff Duffy Bonsai. In this video, I'm going to talk about fingerless gloves. Probably seen in some of my recent videos if you do watch consistently. Thank you to all those people. I've been sporting the fingerless gloves. Now, there's a specific brand that I'll get to that I prefer, but basically, it's good for handling your camera while still keeping your hands relatively warm. Of course, you can access all the buttons very easily when your fingertips are not covered. You can do a lot of stuff with these. This specific brand that I usually buy are from H&M. It's just a generic clothing brand for younger people. You go there, you can buy usually a two pair for around $6 full retail. And also if you go off season or maybe Black Friday, which is coming up, you can actually get these super cheap. Of course, there are specific photographer brands of fingerless gloves or gloves with covers over them and all that jazz, but these ones work really well. They're a simple knit fabric and they have a decent texture on them. My hands are relatively thin and having some type of glove on, especially this time of year, helps out a lot. With the H&M fingerless gloves, you see I've got a nice pack here. We've got some older ones. You can see they do wear out. The wrist area is totally shot with the elastic in there. Still, they're usable even like this, especially if you want to put them under or use them over a good pair. And then that works perfectly. It's thicker, still have the fingers uncovered for all the buttons and all of that. I use them more for just photography. If it's pretty cold out, even inside, I got the fingerless gloves on. With the computer, it works perfectly well to type on the keyboard and all that. Use the mouse, no issues. Of course, I'll probably just use one pair instead of two, but generally works very nicely for computer stuff as well as the photography stuff. All that said, I'm a big fan of fingerless gloves for photography. They work really well, specifically this H&M brand. I haven't found ones that work better for my hands than those, but generally perfect fit, works nicely, low cost, don't want to spend. 20, 30, 40, 50 dollars on some specialty glove if I don't have to. Really like these and I also think they look pretty cool too if you're into that. Anyways, Scott from Dr. Bonsai. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider subscribing. Helps me out a lot. Likes and shares to social networking and all that helps out a lot as well. Thanks again.